This is Etel Adnan, famous for her abstract landscape paintings and her distinct use of color. She worked intuitively to portray her personal experience of a landscape and convey the power of nature through her art. Adnan gained wide recognition within the art world around 2012, but she was already a celebrated writer and poet long before that time. In her practice, writing and painting complemented each other and were closely connected. She said, I write what I see, I paint what I am. In the first retrospective of her work in the Netherlands, her paintings, leporellos, tapestries and literary work are seen alongside the work of Vincent van Gogh, showing their shared love of nature, color and words. Born in Beirut, Adnan lived in California for a long time. She spent the last years of her life with her lifelong partner, Simone Fatal, between Paris and the coast of Bretagne, where we met her for what would turn out to be one of her last interviews. Six months prior to the opening of her exhibition, in November 2021, Etel Adnan passed away at the age of 96. Oh la la, it's, it's huge. I am very sensitive to beauty. We don't speak of beauty anymore. In art criticism, we don't mention beauty. It's demodé, out of fashion. But it isn't really beauty. It's an inner sense, and it makes us happy. It's not complicated. We need it. It's more than shapes and colors. It's more than what you see. Your total inner world is like Van Gogh, in fact. If you look attentively, you can feel his inner problems, his fights. You know him intimately more through his canvases than if you were talking with him. In the 1950s, Etel Adnan moved to California, where she started painting. The Californian sunsets, valleys and mountains inspired her geometric fields of color with the Mount Tamalpais as her most loved and frequent subject. It's a mountain that I used to see through my window. I couldn't escape it. Uh, one day they asked me then, who is the most important person that you ever met? And I said, it was a mountain. I discovered that it's never two, two minutes the same. Uh, when a cloud goes in front of the sun, it's as if somebody put off a light and everything changes. So you realize that we are in a constant change and turmoil. There is no total rest, not only for us, but for the world. Nature is also constantly changing like we do. It is the power of nature that comes to us 
سوکانه و در کانه دو تو از این نیشین تو نیشه این اشت ایتیز از ایف نیشه was alive and conscious and wants to affirm its presence, its power. It is color that makes us realize the intensity of nature. If you feel something strongly, it comes out, you want it or not. You can't escape that. So, as I do re respond to the beauty of the place, of people, of language, of color, and I feel it comes, I want it or not. When we work, our whole being participates in what we do. It's more than just thinking. It's who you are, you cannot escape from. It's going to follow you like your shadow, and it will come out. So let it come out. <laughs>